The delicious secret. Melt in your mouth, explained. Hello and welcome, everyone. Today, we're diving into a tasty expression in the English language. Melt in your mouth. It's a phrase you might have heard in the context of food, but what does it really mean? Stick around as we explore this delicious idiom, breaking down its meaning, origin, and how to use it in your daily conversations. The phrase, melt in your mouth, is used to describe food that is so tender and soft that it feels as if it dissolves in your mouth without much effort to chew it. It's a sign of high quality, especially when talking about meats, chocolates, or any delicacies that are praised for their texture and flavor. This expression conveys a sense of luxury and delight, emphasizing the food's ability to provide an effortless and enjoyable eating experience. While the exact origin of melt in your mouth is not pinpointed to a specific time or place, it's clear that the phrase has been used for quite some time to describe culinary excellence. It reflects the human desire to celebrate and enjoy food that not only tastes good but also has a pleasing texture. Over time, melt in your mouth has become a popular way to express the pinnacle of food quality and satisfaction. Understanding how to use melt in your mouth in conversation can help you sound more like a native speaker and convey your experiences more vividly. Here are a few examples. The chocolate truffles were so luxurious. They just melted in my mouth. You have to try the steak at that restaurant. It literally melts in your mouth. I love how this cheese melts in the mouth. It's so creamy and smooth. These examples show how the phrase can be used to describe different foods and their textures, making your language richer and more expressive. And there you have it, the delicious secret behind the phrase, melt in your mouth, revealed. Next time you enjoy something exceptionally tender and flavorful, you'll know exactly how to describe your experience. We hope this video has not only expanded your English vocabulary but also tempted your taste buds. Don't forget to practice using this phrase in your conversations, and happy eating!